energy depression is a bitch that won't stop texting me and this anxiety hi everybody welcome back so today i wanted to do a different type of shop missy video i know that i do my best and my worst and stuff like that but i really i love shop missy so much but i want to find different ways to talk to you guys about it um different different things that people may want to know or may care about so I went and came up with the idea to grab the 15 things and I could that's the least I could do um, of things from shop miss a that I cannot go without that I will not go without that I that's it for me if you only allow me 15 things to take that's what I'm taking so if you are interested in that type of video, then let's go ahead and get into it. And I'll talk to you all about my favorites. Now, the first thing, I actually brought over one of their new notebooks. Um, because I've been using it. I've been using it like I told you I would for all of my YouTube stuff. I got future video ideas and things in there. Um, but my Willow Lashes. I don't have any on me right now. I'm waiting for them in the mail. But the 3D Foam Ink Willow Lashes, they're named Willow. Willow, Willow, Willow. Um, if Keegan was a girl, her, his name would be Willow. <laughs> we had decided that. Um, but weirdly enough, those lashes and their name, I like them the most. They work best on my eyes because I have almond eyes. So I really, really like those. And if I had to pick, but I mean, I love almond all of their lashes they're all really good the next thing is their moisturizers i won't go without their moisturizers and while we're on the topic of that type of stuff i also won't go without their toners i won't um this is the aha bha pha toner this is their aoa dropper i have my own label that i got from amazon and i labeled them so i can have both when i need both i will never probably consistently because i have to try other other toners but i always will have this in my stock and always come back to using it regularly i love it and the h a h a seven percent one that's what i use when i'm having a lot of problems with my skin so this is amazing i'd have to have it and of course i'd have to have the moisturizer right now i'm using the niacinamide two percent plus bha um, and sometimes I get the Kika Calming Complex one, um, but that one's a little bit thicker, so that's a nighttime type of one for me. And then we have the good old Gua Sha. I just ran it through my little Avani, which you can get on here. They have on sale. Um, I don't know if they still do. Sorry if they don't, but it's usually $300. They're sanitizing, drying, UV system. Um, but it's on sale for $170 something, I think. I don't know. I'll link it for you guys. It's a really good freaking deal. But I put it in my gua sha in there because I just saw something the other day that's like a lot of people don't think to sanitize their their massaging tools for their face. And I was like, shit, I don't. <laughs> so this sucker got washed in the sink and then it got put into the system. So, and that's what's going to happen every single freaking time I use it now because I'm scared. Because that's where I've been breaking out the most is where I use where I use the gua sha the most you guys the next thing this is all I have because I'm waiting on more too are the pimple patches I only have one tiny little they come in a, a bigger thing and you can choose how many you want I get them in bulk because I love them that much I've tried so many and yes they're good but I like AOA I keep going back to the AOA ones I like them better I think they work faster they target better they stick better and they're more invisible so I will always go back to those and then we have hairpins which earlier this week we went in and we talked about maybe I should be a little bit more specific well let me be a little bit more specific here <laughs> these are the types that I like um, I like these ones they're hairpins. I have, they're not, well, yeah, they're hairpins. They're safety pins. I also have earrings that are safety pins um, in my drawer, but these are very firm, and when you open them, it, none of the jewels fall out. None of the jewels fall out. 
Then you have their straight ones, which these are great and come in so many different colors and they're so strong. Then you have their long and bended ones for more hair. So if you have thicker hair, grab the shit out of those. I also have barrets, bar barrettes, whatever you want to call them, um, snake ones. You just clip them in your hair. They have like little clips. These I've never had a problem with. I even have these like chain link clip ones. And these ones have no problem. Sometimes they'll fall off because they're hot glued on. But for the most part, unless you're using it a ton, they work great. Got another light pink one there. I like the hairpins. Um, like I showed you earlier in the week, the one that did not work for me had a lot of gems in it, but they were bigger gems and it was a flower design, something I wouldn't normally order. And I guess that's why. The next thing, who is surprised? Jelly jams. I won't go without these. Nope. Never. Never. I have like 20 backups. Now to save some room because my god, I can't. I would take every single one of these. Some of these I cheat. I cheat. I mean the whole the whole subject, not just one. <laughs> the A20 $10 palettes. I could live off these. I could live off two of these. Yeah, two of them. But I want all of them. I just bought organizers and waiting for them to come in the mail. Okay, okay, I came out with organizers for these palettes. And then, of course, we have the Artista liners. I like these, the purple one stains, and then I found out basically all of them stain, so now I need to rebuy the purple one because I wanted the purple one. I have three browns here because they are my favorite, and then a blue and a green. These work amazing. I repurchased the crap out of them. I would not be able to live without them. And then, like I did with the palettes, cheating cheating with the brushes there are brushes oh there's there's more oh there's more oh and here's another brown artista liner so there's there's tons um the the aoa studio line these brushes i wouldn't be able to go without they have a ton of great brushes ton and it, it hurts me to just say these ones but these are the ones i use the most um, for my eyes, we have the E123, which weirdly, uh, two of these are named the same. These two are named the same when they are clearly different. One is shorter, one is longer. So I don't know if that was a mix-up or they changed them, but I do my cut creases with these and I love them. This one I used today and this is the E113. And that's why I think they mixed it up because these two look more alike. They look more alike. So I just think it's a labeling issue. Um, and then the face ones, F20 and F15. I lied, F12. F12, huge powder brush. Um, F20 I use for blush. I can use for bronzer. I can use for powder. I use for whatever at the time that I grab it for. I mean, that's me with brushes of any type. I don't, I don't use them for what they're for. And then their F19, my favorite highlighting brush. This thing needs to go viral. Viral. This thing is so... It just... It works so good. It works so good. So I love that. The next thing is the setting spray. I would not be able to go without the setting spray. I know. That seems dumb. <laughs> because a lot of people are like, you don't need like primers or setting sprays or any of that if you have to choose. But no, this this setting spray is very, very good. It's very good. And I would need it. The way that I, I uh, no, I would need it. The next thing, I brought every single one because I was not fooling around. I don't know if this is every single one. There might be more, but I have six of the AOA Pro Wear Foundations. I will not go without these. I have them in ivory, sand, buff, more buffs. Like, I have them in my summer shade. I have them in my fairest of winter shades. I don't go without these. I mix these with almost everything. Um, or I use it alone when I want to. 
I will link them, but I always, there's three different links um, for different skin tones. So I will link them to my skin tone, but remember that your skin tone, they have it. They have a ton of different shades. Next we have the sponges, the Moki sponge and the Pawpaw sponge. I mean, if I had to choose, I'd say Pawpaw. No, this is just, this is just the sponge. But the Moki sponge, the one that comes in the value set, that is starting to come in as a contender. I, I, I'm alone with kids way too much. All right, three more items and we are done. I just grabbed my backups. These are the AOA Slim Brows. Could not go without these. I use them all the time. I use them today. I just, I really like these. I have all different colors as well. Um, the next thing here, I've hit, actually hit pan on the AOA Perfect Finishing Pressed Powder. Used it today. It's about almost done. I have a backup. And then, then I have the translucent. And I have a darker shade for summer. This is an ivory. I need to repurchase the ivory one. Um, but I don't hit pan often, if that says anything. I mean, look at that. I'm so proud of myself. And the last thing, which... Actually, it's not the last thing. I think this is 14. Um, this is the AOA Pro Lash Boost Serum. I really like this. My lashes are like kapow. And I told you guys in that one video that I started that March 5th. So I've been using it. It's May 7th now. So I'm using it for about two months. And I definitely think it's worth it. But the last thing... And I laughed when I thought of it because I'm like, I know I'm missing something. They're organizers. And I, I want to say these crates, these crates are wonderful. And they stack on top of each other. So if you're a student or you have an office job, filing system, or if you do something like what I do and you just need to be able to sort things, these are amazing. They come in large, medium, small, and they stack. Um but all their organizers, their sock organizers, their baskets, their crocheted baskets. I mean, they, I wouldn't be able to go without them. I use them every single day and every day I find out that I need more, that I need to order more. So I can't go without them. All right. So that, if I had to choose the 15 things and I bet you, I will probably end up while I'm editing in this editing this see a million other things I would have wanted to have put in this but that's what I grabbed that's what I looked I looked hard okay and this is mostly just in my bedroom I wasn't like really going out into the the house because AOA has made its way out there especially with o OKI and them doing their you know coming out with so many home things there's so much maybe I should do 15 best out there's too. <laughs> what would I even call that? The out there? <laughs> I will list and link everything that I talked about in this video along with everything that I'm wearing. My necklace, if you can see it. My necklace, my bracelets, my makeup, jewelry, all of it. I will list that and everything I talked about in the video down below. Thank you guys so much for watching. <laughs> I really, really value that you guys give me your time here for a little bit. So if you like this video, give me a thumbs up and I'll keep trying to come up with unique ideas. And I, of course, will see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.